Hi guys, tonight is the night before our, it's not a first major climb of the year, but it's the first major climb ever since the pandemic. Um, it's just been recently that um, the mountains and hills uh, near our area were uh, recently opened for public and uh, we found one that is a uh, is it's the near i think it's one of the nearest uh mountain you could climb uh, near our city so we're gonna try that out i've been preparing for this for a couple of weeks already been doing some test climbs um before uh, today and uh, actually i made some videos um on our previous uh, test climb, test hike, um, yeah, and those would uh, probably go up before this video, so do check that out. And I'm just gonna show you guys. I'm gonna give you guys a quick look on what I'll be bringing tomorrow for the hike. And so, so these are the things that I'll be bringing. I'm not sure I'm, I'm not sure what to expect um, with the mountain that we're gonna climb the the name of the mountain is called Mount uh, Kilagas I think it's um, for the specific location it's in Kiliogliboona here in the Philippines so I, I'm not sure if I'm I'll be able to use these gloves but I'm um, just gonna bring that um, just in case I'll be needing one and I got my Salomon. Shout out to Salomon for for these beautiful caps. I did buy these, but uh, yeah, I like their caps. And uh, what else? We have these uh, hydration uh, bottles. It's a soft flask. My wife's bringing her simple hydration. Uh, we're just gonna keep it light because. Um, from what we've heard, uh, I think it's gonna take us uh, around an hour to climb. But I'm not pretty sure if uh, if that's accurate. I think the test hike that we did was like more than two hours, I guess. And I only had um, 500 ml bottles, so uh, I guess this uh, this uh, one soft flask will last me the whole climb. And um, what else? I also have, I have these, I mean, I have this Naked Band. Um, it was one of my favorite um, gears at the moment. Are these considered gears? And then I have my buff, my socks. And I made these, I mean, I made this just a while ago. Actually, it's, uh, it's what kept me up all night. Uh, I was just uh, trying it out, you know, trying to make a paracord bracelet. I was supposed to put this on a a uh, carabiner. Is that what you call it? Carabiner. Um, but uh, I don't have one, so I just uh, tied it up like this. And uh, I'm gonna find somewhere to put that. And uh, I guess that's, uh, that's about it. Got my my jersey and my shorts and of course my cell phone and I, I do have my I do have my watch but it's uh I'm not sure where I kept it but uh, I have that and, and for the shoes I'm gonna I'm gonna use marrow so I guess that's too much information this video is not about my gears but uh, I just want to show you guys um, and I just want to give you guys an idea on what we will be bringing for tomorrow you know, just to give you a picture and I hope I get a good night's sleep it's already uh, it's almost 1 a.m. and uh, the meetup time is 4.30 uh, right before we go on a um, right before we go on a convoy to the uh, to the location so Pretty sure I won't have enough sleep, but um, um, I bet tomorrow is gonna be fun. Yeah, 
but tomorrow is going to be interesting. It's the first time to climb that mountain and it's going to be with friends and I really don't know what to expect. I hope my knees are going to, I hope my knees won't flare up tomorrow. Um, the reason why I would need a sleep is to rest my knees but I, I'm not doing that right now. So I'm just hoping for the best. So I'm going to see you guys tomorrow. Wish me luck.
Limun eh? Oh. Apa cek kuan mukun temporari ke yang style? There you have it. Um, that was our official hike for the pandemic period. And uh, if you could see uh, the, the mountains behind me, that that was uh, that's uh, where we climbed uh, earlier today, and uh, it was a good hike. Uh, it was over a little over a lot. The hike took about around two hours and forty-one minutes, give or take, and um, it was around three point zero nine kilometers. So uh, that's just an estimate. Uh, there were a couple of uh, instances there that I paused my watch, so I'm, I'm not pretty sure how much uh, how much of the uh, time or distance was subtracted. But overall, you get the idea on the time it takes and uh, the distance uh, it took to climb. And actually, so there was a total ascent of 332 meters, and uh, that's a pretty good. Um, ascent. It's a pretty good um, workout for uh, for your legs, and it was fun. And I uh, I highly recommend it. Um, it's it's good for beginners. Uh, it's not totally uh, beginner type, but uh, you could manage uh, climbing up if, if you're still new to it. I'm not sure if um, when it rains. So there were a couple of instances there where it was muddy, but uh, overall uh, it was pretty manageable. Um, I, I don't know uh, the, the difficulty, but I could say you know, it, was, uh, it was fairly easy for us. Um, the ascent was intense. Um, it was ascending most of the way and um, if you do get tired, you know, all you have to do is uh, uh, rest a bit and then, you know, uh, rest for 20 to 30 minutes and uh, you climb up again. So, um, pretty good and uh, we had fun. I guess uh, the route is uh, fairly new. So, uh, it's, a good, uh, it's a good place to, to hike. It's a good place to climb to because there's not a lot of people uh, going there at the moment. So, um, uh, compared to you know, places like Panimahawa where there's lots of groups uh, going up there so uh, I highly recommend it um, one of our friend uh, Kizaya who was supposed to come with us was unfortunately she woke up late so um, um, that's uh, pretty unfortunate but uh, it's good to you know bring your friends as you can see there's a lot of clips there I mean, uh, we're laughing most of the time yeah <laughs> and uh, yeah I, I highly recommend you bring your friends. Um, don't bring too many friends, but um, yeah. Uh, but I guess that's it. Um, it's one of the places that you can hike up to, and um, it's one of the things that you could do during these pandemic times. You know, um, especially in places like this where it's not yet too mainstream. Um, there's not a lot of people there, so it's uh, pretty safe, I guess. Uh, I'm just gonna say I guess because uh, we're not really sure at you know at at this moment. So uh, I guess that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye bye.